What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Zen's Realm. How's your mom doing? How's your dad doing? What's going on with your family? That was a horrible way to start. Boing, boing, boing. <laughs> Welcome back to Zen's Realm, everybody. What's up? I'm just going to jump right into it today because I spent so much time collecting stuff. I'm just ready to build. Let's go. All right, first thing, of course, I need to do is clear the space for where the build is going to go. I've already decided my mine shaft is going to go right here. And that's kind of like the center of this little top area, just like the above ground manifestation of the base. It's just going to be basically a nice little safe haven for me to run into if I'm getting bogged down by too many mobs or something, whatever. So I've just gone through and cleared away this little path so that I know what which sections I'm going to be keeping and which sections I'm not. I'm just going to go ahead and clear all of this out that's on this side of this little trench here. Look at my face. So next thing I'm going to do is just the same exact process except on each layer of this. So I'm going to decide where I want it to be and then I'm just going to clear away anything that's in the way. Pretty simple. Here's before and here's after. I'm pretty proud of it. It looks pretty good and pretty natural. Like it doesn't look like it was completely man-made. I might make a few little adjustments here and there just to make it look a little more random. It does look kind of blocky, but I'm happy with it right now and it leaves plenty of space for my build. There's just one more little thing I need to do to spruce it up, of course. Just throw some bones in my crafting area, get some bone meal and fill in all these bald spots. Okay, I admit it. I went a little overboard with the bone meal here. This this place is completely overgrown. But I mean, it it doesn't look too far off. I'll probably just go around in a little bit and whack a few of these little pieces of grass off the ground. Because it, it's just overboard. Way overboard. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I almost had 30 levels. Oh, gosh. Ah. Oh. I just fell down my mine shaft. There's water down there that's supposed to catch me, but apparently it doesn't work. I don't know what's up with that. That is really weird. Alright, I'm gonna test it out real quick and replace it with vines. I, I don't want that happening again. Oh, there you go. See? You saw it. Everybody saw it. See that? The water did not stop me. I guess this is not working anymore. Gotta get my stuff back here. I'm just going to replace it with vines and test it out a few times. I don't know what's going to happen. Hopefully it'll work more frequently than that water. That's just atrocious. Man. Well, I would suggest not using water, vines, or ladders at all, but using slime blocks at the very bottom. So, I am issuing a warning to anyone who uses vines, ladders, or water at the bottom of your drop shoots because you have to be very careful or you will die, even if you're doing everything right. So you should replace everything with slime blocks at the bottom. Just a warning. But anyway, let's get back to building, shall we? Let's just start out with the foundation.
Oh, that looks really nice up here now. Looks like home. Looks super comfortable. I just want to run in here. I, I, I want to live in here. Man, this looks cozy. Just chill in bed all day, go fishing, whatever. Looks like a nice place to live. Even got your nice base underneath. All right. Let's get back to making the nether portal real quick. So all I'm going to need are some buckets. Oh, here they are. I already have one lo lava bucket. But I know there's a lava pool. I've gotten lucky that it hasn't set everything on fire. I guess it's covered up enough. Don't do it the way I'm doing it, or you might set everything on fire. Which I might do right now. I don't know. I'm kind of taking a risk here. Because I don't have any buckets left. Don't have any buckets left. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. So all I'm going to do is slap these in here and run quickly and get my uh, get my water before everything burns. All right. I made it. No real danger. Nothing to worry about too much. Okay. And you just want to put them all like that. Voila. It's just that easy. Just slap my last ones on here. Almost done. One more. Very good. And I have a flint and steel just for this occasion. Because, of course, I knew I was going to be going to the nether. Eventually. Slap some bushes on there. Would anyone like to say some words for this momentous occasion? Nobody? All right, whatever, let's go. Well, my nether portal kind of spawned in like a low-lying area. So I want to put some kind of markers around. There we go. That should be pretty easy to spot. I'm just going to head in this direction here and hope I run into a nether fortress pretty quickly. I guess I'll see you guys when I find something interesting. Well, I found a nether fortress, but I just realized I was not recording. I had to stop to talk to my girlfriend, and something amazing happened. I just got a wither skull. I killed maybe four or five withers, and I already got one. I am super, super happy with this. I... I have never gotten one so quickly in my life. That was probably just four or five of them, and I already got one. I came from that direction over there, and as you can see, I kind of set up, set up these little areas where they can walk over and get stuck, and then I can kill them pretty easily. They've been spawning quite a bit in this area here, so this might be a good place to have a wither farm later on. I definitely do not want to lose this skull. Because I'm still in shock about it. I've never gotten one this quickly. I was actually just saying how crazy would it be if I got one and then boom, there it is. <laughs> but alright, I just want to grab a couple blaze rods and get out of here before I die and lose my skull. Oh, found another chest here. More horse armor. Nice, a diamond. I can definitely use that. Ah, here's the nether wart room. Very cool. Don't think I'm going to need very much right now. But it's, it's nice to know where they are. Got another chest here. Another chest. Woo, woo, woo. Ah, nothing good. This is my sixth chest. Oh, that's a hall of gold. There we go. This is just like my birthday. This is awesome. I already got a ton of stuff, and I've found two more. Let's see what's inside. More gold. More saddles. Awesome. And for this one, let's see what's in here. More gold and another saddle. Oh my goodness. And a piece of iron. <laughs> One piece of iron. Got tons of gold. Five diamonds. Some iron horse armor. A couple gold horse armor. Three saddles. Oh my goodness. Wither skull. Got my nether wart without even having to pick any over. This has been great. Last thing I need to find is a blaze spawner though. Okay. I'm hearing some blaze. Maybe there's a spawner up here. Nope, just one blaze. Okay, don't want to get too close to him. Let me block this off in case a wither skeleton decides to come in here. Did I get any rods? No rods. This is the second one I've killed with no rods. Huh. Oh, there's our spawner. Got it. Yes. Got one, there we go. 
giving myself some cover here and also keeping the wither skull skeletons out. Let's go for him. Nope, no blaze rods. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I just died. All my stuff is down there. I have to go find it. Oh my gosh. This is this is the worst. This is what always happens. All right. Let's make a quick run back down there if I don't get killed by these. I'm going to get killed in the overworld, too. All right. Good. He's stuck out there. He can't get me. All right. Let's go get my stuff back. I am on a mission. Yeah, this way. Okay, there's all my XP. See if I can get my stuff back. Oh man. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Did I get everything? <laughs> I'm missing my pants. Where are my pants? Oh no. That's a bad sign. That means I might have lost some stuff. Oh good, good, good. There's some stuff down there. Let's grab I don't I don't know. Let's just jump. It's probably a bad idea. Let's not jump. Let's jump here. Here we go. That's not bad. Did I get my wither skull? I got my wither skull. Oh my gosh, it looks like I got everything back, guys. Looks like it. I got super lucky this time. What should I get rid of here? I don't, can't really see anything I can get rid of. Oh gosh. No, not again. No. Oh my gosh, not again. Burnt to a crisp ball fighting a blaze. All right, let's get down here and see what I, oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, my stuff is still here. Where's my wither skull? Where's my wither skull? No, no, oh, it's there, it's there. Oh, it's there guys, it's there. Oh my gosh. Well, it looks like I am missing one gold horse armor, but all in all, that is not a big deal. No way. No way. I just got another wither skull. I am on my way to three. This is crazy. Oh no. I've angered the pigmen. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my gosh. And there's a gas. This is awful. This is awful. I've angered the pigmen. <laughs> How did I manage to do this? Is that a zombie? Is, is that a zombie in the nether? What? Guys, guys, look at this. What's going on? There's a zombie in the nether. <laughs> Nothing special about him. Except for he's in the nether. <laughs> well, that was quite an ordeal, but I made it home safely with uh, all the stuff I have here. With both my wither skulls and all this good stuff back at home, I think this is a good place to end the episode. Join me next time where I build my storage room, a boat dock, a tunnel to the ocean, and heck, maybe even a lighthouse if I have time for it. Leave me a like or subscribe if you feel like it. There's no pressure. But be sure to leave me a comment to tell me what kind of projects you think I should take on and how I can improve generally. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.